just got out of Costco. I'm creeping in my car. Um, the damage is done. Oh my gosh. It was a big haul and some of it was not on the list. I got a lot of snacks that I've had before. Some of them, some of them tried my kids, bleh, tried at my sister's house and they'll like eating them and they're good little treats. And so I'm excited to share them with you in the haul. All right, first things first, we needed a new, new one, a new garbage can. This one is um, coming off of rebate at Costco, but it has a foot pedal, which I'm excited. You know, the push, you step on it and it pops up. So fancy. Look at that garbage can. <laughs> the things you get excited about. Okay, um, organic, pro organic protein, just the vanilla flavor. They, this comes in... Um, Reese's peanut butter cup or chocolate and chocolate too, I think. Um, Jesse likes the vanilla one and he adds his own peanut butter, like that's peanut butter powder you can add if he wants to, or he'll just drink it plain. I have never tried it, but I'm planning on to trying it. Um, this time I read online that it's better to have organic protein powder. This one's vegan, no soy, gluten-free, non-GMO. I mean, you can read anything online. I don't know if that's true. Let me know. Um, I have, okay, so we'll do the bread first. Dave's Killer Bread. Um, they didn't have any of the white bread, so I got the 21 whole grains. The kids typically, like, eat around the crust on this, but if they get some of the crust, that's fine. These are organic coconut crispy rollers. Um, they are not as big as this, but they kind of look just like they do. Right here, my nail looks dirty. I was just playing outside with the kids, don't worry. And um, it um, is really good. Like I like it with yogurt and it has chia seeds in it. And it's about 13 servings per, con per container and 10 rollers per serving. They're gluten-free, vegetarian, paleo. I have a dog I'm watching. Ari, it's okay. Hi, hi boy, you're all right. Anyways, and um, it contains tree nuts, aka coconuts, eggs, and sesame seeds. Uh, or you can dip them in almond butter, peanut butter. They're just so good. I wonder how it would be like with um, chicken and um, like teriyaki chicken or rice or something. I don't know. These, that's it. These are mini. So I really like the small serving size of these for like a kid snack on the run. Eight strawberries, eight mangoes, eight blueberry flavored. They're 24 mini bars gluten-free and there are only two two ingredients in each bar I'll show you the nutrition um 60 60 60 and it's just crazy all the strawberry one has apples and strawberries I mean they all have apples so the mango one has apple and this has um apple and it's just the press no preservatives no ad preservatives no added sugar they're vegan I mean I'm trying to feed them better food this is my, um, I typically have this, and then I bought the coconut straw things, whatever you saw. Um, pumpkin seed flax granola with my um, yogurt. I wonder how other people eat granola. I'm just not that creative. I guess you could put it on, what does it say? Breakfast or day, you could just eat it plain, I guess. Three-fourths cup is one serving, and it's 260, or you can have it with skim milk, and that's 300. Do people really drink skim milk? I don't know. Um, pears. I just thought this would be a good change. This was a huge bag. I'll put the prices to everything as you're seeing them. Um, I just couldn't. Are these pears? Yeah, they are pears. I was worried that I bought like something else. But um, no, it's, it's so heavy. I can't. I'll have to look up some other recipes to make with these. Almond butter cups. These. Look at these babies. Do, do, do. They have to put huge flavors. This is not the actual size of the item, people. You're not getting a huge almond butter cup. 
but it um, has dark chocolate, which I believe is better for you. And I thought, oh, this would be a good little treat for the kids to get to have. One piece is 80 calories. It can be their little pick-me-up emergency stash, it says. And I like how it's with almond um, butter. I wish they had a white chocolate almond butter one. I would totally eat that. These um, go, go squeeze. We like to take hiking. And they were on like $4 off right now. So it's just a good time to stock up because you never know when you're going to need them. Um, the, this black bean chipotle burger I've been wanting, but they're gluten-free vegan. So we do no meat on Fridays and you know, just like you can do a meatless Monday. We try to just do it all year round to not have meat on one day at least of the week because, um, it's just good to not have to have meat every meal. It's hard. You get into the habit. So we try not to have that habit and I'm so excited. I'll probably have one of these tomorrow though to eat these. Where is the information? They're, Jesse can have them. They're vegan, gluten-free, 250, 250 calories for one burger. I mean, and you don't even have to have a bun with it. You can have it in a bowl. And that's how I like to eat it with Buddha bowl-ish. Blueberries. Raspberries. We're burying you out. And da -da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. three, not one, one, two, three things of strawberries because we have some strawberry lovers right now. And if they're going to have a strawberry or they're going to have a fishy cracker, which we don't have, I am going to give them a berry. JoJo's Guilt-Free Chocolate Bars. Jesse and my brother-in-law um, really like these. Dark chocolate, pistachios, almonds, and cranberries. It does sound really good. 180 calories, 8 grams of sugar, and 5 grams of protein. Gluten-free, dairy-free, blah, 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 blah. It sounds really good. I love pistachios. Um, strawberries. The kids wanted some strawberry smoothies, but I wouldn't make them with the fresh strawberries. I told them, I will buy you some frozen strawberries because it's just a better deal. So this huge bag, you know, was way better deal than buying my own strawberries and freezing them. The kids needed more vitamins. These are the organic ones of the Smarty Pants. They have a non-organic, which are, I think, $2 cheaper. And I don't know how many um, gummies are in that pack. So I can't tell you like, okay, it's a better value or whatever. But I just wanted to get them the Smarty Pants organic because I'm trying, I'm trying to make up for it when I can. Um, veggie straws, these were on um, sale today or whatever you want to call it. Uh, Jesse can have these. They're all right. I mean, you can have so many straws compared to chips and it gives you that salt flavor if you're needing like the sea salt flavor crunch instead of going to turn to a chip. Um, speaking of chips, the Kate Pod chips are going to go off sale soon, so I bought a bag of those. And they'll just, see, 30 servings, so you are per container, you can have 19 chips in it. That's 130 calories versus veggie straws, 130 calories, and you can have 38 straws. So that is so many more. You know, if you're having a hungry day and you know you just want to get seconds after seconds, this would be a better choice to grab than um, the Cape Cod chips. But if you want chips, you want chips. Pistachios, the kids, I recently discovered, because I had small little packs of these, and they kept fighting over, like I had two packs, and they kept making me shell the nuts so they could eat them. So I was like, well... This is $15, I believe, if I'm saying that correctly. If not, look up in the screen. And why not just buy this? And they can have like a pistachio and an apple for a snack. And they will be happy little clams. Happy little clams. Uh, this um, Amy Lou breakfast links, they were $3 off right now. So we just always try to buy one when it's on sale because I like to eat them for breakfast. I think it's serving size is three. Links. I usually have two just because I am not a man, but it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm just saying what I eat, eat when you're hungry, but it just, 
has such good raised without antibiotics, no nitrates, gluten free. It's delicious. We bought um this flank steak. It's the USDA choice, not the prime. Um, because I'm just making top ramen with it. And like part of it. It was twenty four dollars. I'll probably end up making top ramen and like carne asada um with this and then we'll say like with one of them and then we'll save the other one because it's a lot of meat a lot of the meat and then organic sorry i'm a weirdo organic flu agave we're out of this i like to have this in my coffee it's it tastes sweeter than honey to me i mean i think it's supposed to have less sugar i'll have to compare it one day organic coconut oil we were at almost out. Yes, it's crazy that we can go through that much. But we don't cook with butter, so. And then um, these apples uh, were a great buy, as usual. And the kids, like, I have to peel my kids' apples. And then they like me to core them now. And that's how they like to eat them. So, I go, we go through a lot of apples. I think we went through, like, ten this week. So, I got these for the kids. And then for Jesse and I, if Jesse wants them, I got the Envy apples. These are more expensive and they're bigger um, apples. I don't really like the plastic container they come in. That's not very environmentally friendly, but I like the apples. And um, then I got bananas. Not organic because the organic ones were turning yellower and I wanted the green ones. So, I mean, silk and then hi. Hi, Mater. And then just normal 2% milk, a nut milk, and a regular milk for Jesse. I mean, nut milk for Jesse, regular milk for us. And that was our haul. All right, so thanks for watching the Costco haul. That is all we have right now. And I'm going to get this stuff put away before the strawberries unfreeze. What a disaster. I'm going to cut up some strawberries and prep them, so maybe I'll stick a oh around for that and I'm going to try and think of what I want to have for a snack tonight. It is Friday so I don't, I'm not having yogurt. I'll probably have popcorn. I love popcorn. We buy the big Costco container of popcorn. It's such a great deal. If you have kids, it's a good treat on Friday and that is it. I am beat. So thank you for watching. We hope you have a good week. Um, and enjoyed my spending spree. Last haul Jesse went to and he did not spend as much as me. And now I'm feeling like I just bought everything in the store. So thanks for watching and hope you have a good night and always rise with shine.